not following any recipes. Soap and scrub brushes. We started with the vodka. I like anything spicy. I'm going to show you how easy it really is to make, how to put together an outfit. We want you to do everything that you feel good about. These are so good, y'all. Don't mind me, because we can, can and you can too. I'm Stacy Johnson. Welcome back to another episode of Because We Can. As you can see today, it's just me, but that's because sometimes schedules don't work out. Busy schedules happen. Laura can't be here today. I can't be there when she's going to be available. So we are going to bring content to you no matter what. So like I said, you might see Laura, you might see me, and you'll see us back together. But hey, let's get started on this project. This is what I'd like to call a fall urn update. I have taken out the tropical that we planted earlier, and they didn't really like being taken out of their pots, as you can see. So I'm going to have to give them a little more love later. But for right now, we're going to show you what we're adding. I went ahead and kept in the dusty millers of the vine and I added some more soil to make sure the roots are covered up. And now we are going to put a fall look. We are going to put this pretty purple fountain grass up into the urn to continue to give it some height and fall color. Might add some, mum, well actually will add some mums as well to bring in some fall color. And then during another time, you can add other things to it like Maybe at Halloween, put a little pumpkin or a skull, little legs sticking out here and there. We'll see about that. But for right now, let's get started on this. I'm going to put on my trusty gloves. Don't want to mess up the manicure. Just got that worked on today. And here we go. It's much easier when Laura and I are helping each other, though, isn't it? Now I've got to do all this by myself. <laughs> okay, so I'm grabbing this, taking it out of the pot. I'm going to loosen up these roots a little bit try to figure out where we're gonna set it just kind of stick it in there like that I wanted to leave some more space towards the front because like I said I like to sometimes add other things during different parts different holidays kind of give that holiday decor and now I'm going to grab these mums we are just going to take one out Gently though, we don't want to damage it. But we are gonna kind of loosen the roots a little bit. Stick that in there. Around the dusty melon vine. We're gonna take this other little mum, different color, kind of give it some variety. Stick that there. And up, oh, let's see that one's gonna go maybe right here. Look, we're just putting it like that. Have the little dusty knives, the vine, and ta-da! How easy was that? Gave it a whole new look while still using your spring and summer plants. It's going to get a little bit of water, a little bit of love, and we're going to be just fine. Adding a little bit of soil too. Right around it. Okay, so we're going to add the soil all its nutrients get it in there see this is such an easy project such an easy update and then we'll put more on this side we're just covering it up because we want to make sure it's all in there happy in its new home it's nice to make sure that you have all your products right around you so you're not having to run around, get the soil after you plant, get the water. So I like to have everything set out ahead of time. See, we're just adding it right there. I'm gonna hide from you for a second. Get all this. Okay, we're covering it up with that. Making a little bit of a mess, but that's okay. That's what planting is for, making a mess and having fun. Okay, there we go. I want to 
I cover that. Make sure the roots are covered up. Make sure it's in there. Press it down a little bit. There we go. See, I can't tell you. This is so easy. This is such an easy update, isn't it? I think so. So there we go. And there you have it. Press down on these. Still have room for some other items if we want. Like I said, fall, always nice to have some gourds, pumpkins, fun little items right there. Press that down. Give it just a touch of water. We've had quite a bit of rain around here, and so I don't want to overwater, but I always like to give it just a little, little bit where we just planted. And then there you have it. Look, once it's in there, it's gonna freshen up a little bit is what I like to say. It gives it some time to enjoy its new home. So there, we have it, a fall urn update. Hey, if you have more ideas for us, if you have something you'd like to see, please let us know. Please tell your friends about us, subscribe, like. We'd love to hear from you because we can and you can too.